Guys, we're gonna make a copy of Europa Universalis 3 in chat, guys. Good luck, good luck. It's pretty good chicken, though, mnemonic. I mean, like, if you're complaining about the cost of food, like, you can make that same argument for, like, literally any restaurant besides, like, McDonald's. <laughs> I'm too dumb for that game. <laughs> Good luck at the giveaway. What's up, Frex? Yeah, you don't have to swear in on the Bible, but like if you don't, like it's like looked down upon. In our society, like if you if you choose not to. Religion's definitely becoming um like uh, religion's never gonna go away. It's existed for thousands of years, but it's definitely in our at least in the US, it's definitely like for younger people, like a lot less common. Chill stream, yeah, we're chilling. We're chilling. We're chilling. In court, um, MSK to get sworn in in certain jobs and stuff too. So to, to be sworn in for being president. Um, let's see. We're almost out of energy. Um, we can. What do we spend our energy on? Plucking weeds and and building things, right? Yeah. Did we? Did, so do we have enough for Tarek's house or no? We do have. Oh, this house. Oh, this is a cool house. Um. Uh, where do we want to put his house? There's room over here. We could do like a row of houses here. We might. We're probably gonna have to move his house once he like wants something built. But whatever. MSK the thousand bleed hearts and the 100 Jeff Bezos bits. Happy birthday, Kiwi. Thank you, MSK, for the bits. No, thank you for the message. <laughs> Gonna reject the message. I'll take the bits. Thank you. <laughs> Oregon State flag is the only flag in the U.S. that have different designs on each side. The for the state seal and the observe and a gold figure of the beaver on the reverse side. Two parts of a whole, which makes things unique. Just like linking your Amazon Prime and Twitch account. Those two parts uh, make the unique free monthly sub to logo. <laughs> Thank you, Russell. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. I read it very fast because it was like scrolling off my screen. So I was like, <laughs> like, I need to read this very, very quickly. Thank you very much, Russell. Great message. A lot of it is tradition. Those, these are hard to come by. Oh, rip Graylem. Sorry. Sorry, Graylem. Uh, Ahmad can repost it. Sorry. Uba gets cranky sometimes. No, thank you very much. No, thank you, Russell. Really slumky. Interesting. Interesting. Ah, what a magnificent building you have crafted. Loco, I have something to confess. Although this is peacetime, my heart still burns for perilous adventure. As a proud knight, it's been very hard for me to adjust. I feel as though I don't have a purpose anymore. Huh? You found a new purpose here in Potato Town? Of course. Our hero had to adjust to this new life, so I must as well. Religion can give you solid lessons, but taking things literally and thinking it's the only way things are is just not thinking for yourself. I'll use myself as an example. I'm Christian, but I don't think my way of worship has to be done by everyone. My opinion, divine creator that I call God reveals themselves in many ways. If others don't believe in any divine creator, I'm okay with that too. Just respect my right to believe and I respect you right now too. That is like literally the best way you could summarize religion, Graylim. Like, I wish more people would 
<laughs> think like that. Like, yeah, like you can, like, I don't have a problem with people celebrating, their, uh, celebrating, uh, <laughs> believing, the practicing their religion, <laughs> celebrating their religion. Celebrate good times. Come on. Da -na -na -na. Na -na. Come on. Arrows, congrats on winning the giveaway. Enjoy your game. And thank you, TQs, for donating that. Thank you very much. Um, but as long as you're not like, like, but the, yeah, there are like, like, as long as you're not, uh, using religion to, you know, as a excuse, I guess, to murder people or believe that other humans are lesser, uh, you know, um, stuff like that, like, for, 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 bad and malicious reasons, you know? Not even religion, all things. Let me do my thing and you do yours. Yeah. Yeah, that's a crazy concept, MSK. It's crazy. Like, let people live, man. Or imposing your beliefs on others. That's the big one for me. Believe what you want. Just don't make other people. Yeah. Like, if your religion makes you against eating cheese. Don't put others down or think lesser of people for eating cheese. And definitely don't enact a law that bans cheese for everyone else. And don't murder people because they eat cheese Jesus don't make this about cheese I'm sorry <laughs> uh, apparently it's an insane concept it seems pretty pretty reasonable to me all right Tarek what do you got for us I have a new quest to accomplish I shall learn many new things and find a purpose here in Potato Town. Find your purpose, Tarek. I think it was you who defeated the Dark Wizard. I am in great company. Truly magnificent. I bow down to Jesus. Praise Jesus. <laughs> oh my gosh. Tarvin, please. What? Like, some people enjoy stinky cheese. Just don't make me eat stinky cheese. I actually think there's a, there's a... I love getting, like, cheese plates at nice restaurants. And you get all these cool cheeses. I'm just like, pick some, and I'm going to try them all. Like, you just get to taste different cheeses. Because, like, I don't really, like... I guess, for me, cheese is kind of like... Like, wine, too, is, like... I'm not an expert on all things like cheese and wine. I like, I, I, I'm just open to like trying everything, you know? So I'm like, give me some cool cheeses. Let me try some things. I'll figure out what I don't like and what I do like. Bam, 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 bam. I'm not going to look at his desk because I don't want it to spoil what he could potentially give me because I keep doing that. I think I need to move that tree. It's going to annoy me. We'll put it right here. We all live life in our own unique way and to force your own religious be beliefs on someone else and ex to expect it to work is ignorant because we all have our own experiences, not uniform as all. Thanks for coming to my TED talk. Love you all. Yeah. Pretty sure they're cheese platters, but you do you. What do you mean? What do you mean? They're cheese platters. Don't like dairy, don't consume dairy. Do you not like dairy? I already talked to those people today. I always forget when I get when I when I stop playing in the middle of a day. I'm like, what have I done today? Let's go to the forest and stuff. I think that's the last thing. So we built the house. 
Let's go check for some loot. Oh, really, Aaron? That's cool. Hmm, not much here today. We'll take this. Yeah, I guess we'll pluck some of these weeds. And then we'll go to the mine. What? Let's go to the mines. Hello, Grassy. Anyone else finish an entire bottle of Parmesan cheese in one sitting? I mean, I probably get pretty close. I love Parmesan cheese. <laughs> I love cheese. The only thing is my right now my only snack is cheese and it's like I love cheese but like I just I need other things or just something with the cheese. I want to go to the store tomorrow. I need to get more snacks cuz I am out. Literally just not munching on cheese. Oh boy, this is going to be fun. Oh god. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Ah! Go! Whew, okay. Got there just in time. Thanks, are grassy. What? Not a liquid? What the hell? Like, yeah, like a, yeah, you just like, like a, like, what would you, uh, it's like a container, I guess. A container? Hey, Stefan, how you doing? We say Parmesan, Parmesan, Parmesan. Oh, you know what? I wonder if it's like you have to get to a certain level relationship with people to unlock new things. That's probably what it is. A plague of weeds. Okay, what? Oh, this event's not going on right now, I guess. I'm assuming. Let me read the sign. Yeah, not available yet. Okay. I wonder what that, that, that's going to be like, though. Who's Farmer Jean? Hi, <laughs> Cozy. This game is so addicting. I'm loving it. It's so great. It's great. Parmesan. Oh, yeah. We say aluminum, which is just so dumb. Aluminum instead of alu aluminium. Aluminium. But it's spelled like we just ignore the I at the end. We're just like, no, oh, I'm gonna. It's so silly. Do we spell it differently? Do we? Feels weird without the I. Why do we, what's the point in spelling that differently? Like, why? Why do we do that? I just don't get it. Someone tell me a logical reason why we just is it's the same thing right we're talking about the same thing right like what is wrong with us why do we switch to r e and e r like theater and theater i don't know <laughs> i don't know Aluminium. I'm just going to say it aluminium. Yeah, somehow the word belogna is meant to be said baloney. <laughs> like, guys, let me just smash my face on my keyboard and make up a new word. Like, like, what? I don't know, man. It's so silly. All right, I need to use the restroom and get water. Give me two minutes.
I'm not a joke, Moses. Oh. What is the Bologna situation? I don't think people say Bologna unless they don't know like that it's baloney, but I just don't know why it's even spelled that way. Breaking out the vodka. <laughs> this discussion about Bologna is making me want to be drunk. <laughs> It's Bolon Bologna, a, re a region in Italy, Bologna. But isn't it spelled B A L O N E Y in other places? Bologna, Bologna, is it Bologna? I actually like bo I like bologna. Um, it's not a, like it's not healthy. <laughs> it's uh, I actually do like bologna though. Guilty confession. Bubsy gave me a erythal or or. I just butchered this. Or it's a ritual cum. A ritual cum. Oriculum. Oriculum. Orichalcum. Nope, I give up. I'm just gonna call it some ores. <laughs> I got ores! So no one will hang out with me today because it's an event day. Okay, this morning I made more progress with controlling my magical abilities. Here, I'll show you this cool new spell. What? Now it's not going to work? Sure. Oh, I, di I didn't, don't know. I always thought my hair is rather plain. No, you have nice hair. You have nice wavy hair. Yeah, I used to eat bologna and cheese sandwiches. What's Javu? <laughs> hey, Ginger. Yeah, I mean, bologna is not the best for you. It's not. It's not the best for you. But it's just like sometimes you just want some bologna. What does bologna actually mean for you? It's 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 sliced meat. It's like apparently there's like horse hooves in bologna. So I started, I switched to beef bologna. Um, I mean, I don't eat it like regularly. Like I'll get it every now and then. It's like this like mixed up meat. I don't know, man. I don't know exactly what's in it. I try not to try to, I try, I try not to figure that out. It's kind of like hot dogs, really. I mean, it doesn't taste the same, but I mean, it's like the same, like it's like a meat mixture. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Really, some key? A Caragon. Ooh, we have uh, crops ready. Let's get the farming brew. What's up, trumpets? How's it going? Do, 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 do. My wife and I decided we we're going to get cheap bologna and craft ma American cheese, Miracle Whip, and white bread to remember what it was like to be kids. I was going to say, like, uh, we each had one bite of the sandwich and spat it out. Everything about that sounds horrible. <laughs> Everything about that. Like, I don't eat any of those anymore. Like, like I said, bologna every now and then. American cheese? Like... Really not at all, unless like I get like a burger at a restaurant. Really, I think it's usually a mix of pork and poultry and all the bits they can't sell otherwise. Yeah, it's it's yeah. Um, 
The meat industry is really gross if you like actually look into it. Like that, you could easily go vegetarian if you look into that kind of stuff. Like it's. Oh wait, no one's hanging out with me. It's uh, it's it's pretty, it's pretty nasty what we what we eat. like. Everything. I mean, the good thing is everything gets used. Um, a lot of it, go like a lot of the crappy stuff goes back into animal feed. They feed it to pigs and stuff. And some of it goes into things like bologna and hot dogs. The company's making good bologna. They'll use choice cuts of meat in the bologna, but the company's making it as an afterthought. Then it's organs, trimmings, end pieces, etc. Yeah. Never said the desire of eating those meats and cheeses when you eat can eat proper meats and cheeses. Um, I think that it has to do with a lot of things. I think it's cost, uh, convenience, um, just culture too. Like just like putting like bologna sandwiches just becomes a thing, and then you're just like, I like bologna, and then you eat bologna, right? It's not like you get introduced to bologna as an adult, and then you're like, well. You look at what's in it and you look at like an alternative and you're like, well, why would I eat that? It's like, you know, you just eat it as a kid and you like it and you're just like, and then it's like, oh, I'm American, like craft cheese and let me eat bologna with my sandwich. <laughs> oh no. I mean, it doesn't, bologna doesn't taste bad. Like it, it sounds like it's, right? It's like it has like pretty nasty ingredients, like, right? But it's like, it tastes good. Like, like if it tasted bad, no one would eat it. It's like, like I said, basically like hot dogs. Yeah. Never had bologna. I've never liked bologna. Interesting. When I was a kid, we used to camp at a pig farm and saw the pigs get slaughtered. I still eat pork. I've seen a pig uh, get... Um, uh, like uh, electrocuted to to be killed, and I did not eat pork for a long time after that. And I've never been like a huge fan of pork, but there was definitely I was like, hmm, hmm, I don't want that anymore. All of a sudden, let's hang out with. Can we hang out with Lilith? Because we don't really know her that well. No, we can't. Electrocuted, yeah, basically they put this giant God, I'm sorry, uh, trigger warning? Uh, they put this giant Like it looks kind of like a like, I don't know, like this, this prong piece of equipment and they I don't want to, I don't want to illustrate in case someone mutes <laughs> They put it on its head and yep, it was really disturbing. It was very disturbing. Like even talking about it makes me kind of like nervous. Like just like, oh, uncomfortable. So yeah, it's like a probe type thing. They put it on its head. And then they uh, let the blood exsanguinate. It depends on what you're doing with the pig or the animal, right? Then you exsanguinate it sometimes. Uh, I think most of the time, actually. Yeah, the smell was, um, something I, I could not put into words. Like... It will make you not eat pork. <laughs> it will definitely make you not eat pork. Um, okay, so we have the farming thing. We need to find a buddy. I don't know, man. Does Lilith want to hang out with us? Oh, this is Willow. Wait, oh wait, is today the weeds day? Oh, it is the weeds day. No one will hang out with us. Is that onion? Is that an onion that's ready? Oh, it's a potato. I always think they're onions, but we can't make onions yet, so... I was in animal science, uh, Sir Sam Vines, and I used to do, uh, research. For like three, four years? Three, three years. I think I have some key. I think I've tried it before. P 
Pete with the 16 months. What's up, Pete? Just got back from graduation. Hey, con congratulations. If it was your graduation. Congratulations. Oh, we got to put more stuff in the shop. And we have new stuff at the town hall, so we should do that. Yeah, pancake. It's got a it's got a similar vibe actually. Fruit trees. Hmm. I don't really care about this right now, but I'll do the chances. Like I always invest in like chances for things. We need wooden planks. Let's do some crafting today. Let's see what we can craft. Oh, wow. Look how tall that tree is. What's up, Supernova? Um, yeah, Salty. I mean, I, I, I don't know, man. Like, like, I mean, like, you know, I, I, I don't know. Lately, I've, I've been more conscious about that kind of stuff. Um, I didn't see like that was like the biggest thing that I saw in person, but I've definitely learned a lot about like that, that kind of like the meat industry and stuff like that. Um, I don't know, man, like kind of the same reason why a lot of people, they'll see that stuff and they are not affected by it, I guess, like where it's just like you don't really think about it when you eat meat every single time. It doesn't come to your head like. I don't know, I think. Lately, my perspective or my values have changed a bit where like like now I'm trying to I, I, I don't drink like regular milk anymore. I'm drinking soy milk or not soy milk, um, oatmeal, oat milk and almond milk. But apparently almond milk is not great for the environment right now because it uses a lot of water. Uh, oat milk is actually really good. So I told you guys I did the vanilla oat milk. Um, and it was kind of like cake battery. It was kind of weird, but I did the non vanilla. I did regular oat milk and it tasted fine. It tasted like regular milk. So I was like, okay, this works. Okay. Let's see about upgrades. Yeah, I need to go get stone and I need to get wood. Like regular stones and regular wood. Coconut milk? Yeah, I don't like coconut. The only thing I'll do with coconut is I'll do it with um, curry. Because you don't actually taste the coconut. <laughs> I didn't know you switched to oat milk. I did, yeah. And it's great. It tastes good. It's got good texture too. Like honestly, uh, the van like I said, the vanilla oat milk kind of tastes... A uh, little cake battery, not in texture, but just like the flavor. But regular oat milk tastes fine. Tastes great. So yeah, highly recommend checking out oat milk uh, if you're looking for some alternatives. 